Mr. Beagley. Hey there guys and gals, it's Grabeagly, and today it's just a short little video. I wanted to announce something about St. Jude that some of you guys might know about already. I don't know if you do or not, but uh, yeah, I checked the mail the other day and I got a little package there and St. Jude had sent me some socks. And these are actually really nice socks. I really like them a lot. They're cozy. They like feel really nice and soft. It's going to be perfect for the winter here in New York where it's always like freezing and horrible. So this was a nice little surprise, but this is actually not the St. Jude announcement that I wanted to make for you guys. St. Jude is an amazing organization. You guys know that I raise tons and tons of money for them every single year. I have a lot of personal investment in the company. It's one of those charities that just has done a lot for people in my life and a lot for tons and tons of kids out there who suffer from cancer and other diseases and it's just an incredible organization so what I did was I recently got partnered with pop sockets yes the official brand of like phone grips that you put on your phone cases or on your phones and it's awesome it's really cool because they're like a big brand and I applied through their poptivism program which allowed me to submit a design and that design is now on a featured pop socket that has some of the funds go towards St. Jude itself. So a really cool thing for a really cool cause. I'm really psyched about it. For those of you guys who don't follow me on Twitch, this is going to sound like a weird foreign language, but I selected the Gerb Iaia emote that we use on Twitch a lot to like celebrate happiness and cuteness and whatever. So uh, I'll put that up somewhere here on the screen, but that's featured now on a pop socket. And if I have enough of these sell, I'll be able to like put up more designs and whatnot. But I want to see how this one does because there is like a quota that we have to hit month after month. And uh, as long as we do, I think it's like 20 units within two months, then the design will stay up indefinitely and will continue to benefit this charity that I care so much about. But it's really, really cool. If you guys go directly to the link that I'll put down below in the description, you'll be able to buy one of these pop sockets. Again, officially branded pop socket. So you know, it's not coming from a weird third party or something and it's going to be of high quality which was a really important thing for me because you guys have been asking for these for a while I wanted to make sure that it was the like highest quality that we could get but these pop sockets none of the uh the money goes to me just for for full transparency I'm not getting any of this funding uh 50 goes directly to St. Jude to help fund their hospital and 50 I believe goes to pop sockets just to cover the cost of manufacturing and shipping and everything like that that as most companies do but it's a cool initiative it's a cool way to get some like gerbigly merch and also support a cause that means so much to me and so much to this community and especially with things like the coronavirus being such big news right now it's like really in the public eye you know everyone's talking about it all the time but uh, especially with things like that and flu season and whatnot, um, one of the things that people don't realize about St. Jude is not only do they treat cancer patients, but they also treat kids with illnesses which affect their immune system. So a lot of these kids in the hospital are immunocompromised, whether it be from chemotherapy or it be from another illness. And as a result, they're at a very high risk where if they get something like corona or the flu or just any foreign contaminants within them, it poses a very, very big risk. So St. Jude obviously uses a lot of the funds that come in around like this crisis time that we're in to help care for those kids, make sure that they're safe, make sure that they have access to all of the best equipment, all of the best medicine, all of the best treatments, etc. And with your help, we can raise some money for them. And it's just one of those things that, again, like I said, a lot of you guys were asking for pop sockets. So if you want one, you can now get one directly from the Pop Sockets website. Uh, it's through their Poptivism charity incentive that they're doing right now, where they're raising money for a variety of charities. And obviously, I had to go ahead and pick St. Jude because it's just such a great organization. But yeah, that's going to be it for this announcement, guys. Just nice and quick. Uh, just wanted to let you guys know about this because it's something that our community is incredibly passionate about. We've raised over a grand total of like $20,000 for St. Jude. I'm pretty sure it's like even higher than that because that's the only amount that I can track through uh, Tiltify, the website that we use to raise funds. I, I don't remember how much we raised for them ahead of that before we started using that platform. So we've raised at least $20,000 for St. Jude 
over the years and it's an initiative that obviously we're going to keep up we're going to continue with uh there was recent news if you guys follow me on twitter where i mentioned that the saint jude uh play live summit that i attend every single year in memphis was canceled just because of the risk again of bringing foreign contaminants to the hospital where these kids are where it would like spread among staff and kids so quickly and serve such a giant risk and obviously we wanted to avoid that so that summit was unfortunately canceled but for very good reason and they're moving to like a digital format where I guess I'll get to tune in and partake in a bunch of different activities and represent our community in that and I'm really looking forward to that as well because again you know this is an initiative that we have been a part of for such a long time and we've done so much good through so again uh, hopefully it's something you guys continue to love and to support as much as I do and uh, if you do decide to get one of those pop socket grips please let me know you know tag me over on Twitter or leave a comment here or whatever I'd love to see that you guys are supporting this cause it really does mean a lot but uh, anyway guys again this is gonna be it for this video I hope that you enjoyed it if you did please be sure to hit the like button subscribe to the channel and as always it was great seeing ya bye bye Sir Piggly!